Hi, welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to learn how to find the area of an oblique triangle. Well, first let's define what is an oblique triangle. And an oblique triangle is a triangle that is any triangle that's not a right triangle. So we know how to find the area of a right triangle. We just multiply one half base times height. We multiply the two legs together and divide by two. So if you don't know that height, you can use this formula all the time. So area, that's what this A represents. Area is equal to one half B, C, and take the sine of A. So what do we mean by sine of A? Well, A is one of the angles in the triangle, and it could be an obtuse angle or it can be an acute angle. And B and C are the adjacent sides or the sides next to the angle. So let's work through one. It's a very simple formula. You're just going to find the area by taking one half times each of the adjacent legs. So in this case, B is right here and B is 10. So let's plug that into our formula times C, and C is 8.5, 8.5, and we're going to multiply that times the sine of 26 degrees in this example. We have a nice little acute angle at 26 degrees. So we're going to get our calculators and multiply this all together. Now, the one thing you need to remember about a ca the calculator is you need to make sure that the calculator is set in degrees. So let's check our calculator. I'm going to hit the mode button and make sure my calculator is in degrees, and it is. So let's quit and go back to the home screen. And I'm going to take 1 half or 0.5 times 10 times 8.5 times the sine of 26 degrees. And you can just type in 26 and hit enter. So the area is 8.63 square units. What was that again? I think I said 8, but it's 18.63. Square units. And that's how we find the area of an oblique triangle if we have an angle and two adjacent sides.